channel so today I'm basically doing a video on how I created this wig so if you're interested in this wig and how I made it then keep on watching okay see you later hey guys so to make this lace frontal wig I'm gonna be using a dome cap and right now I'm just putting it on top putting the lace frontal on top of the dome cap and kind of positioning it to the way that I'm gonna how I want it so I can sew it down so now I'm going to go ahead and just pin it down with some pins just to have it all in place so I don't get confused on where I'm sewing it, I mean, yeah, on where I'm sewing it down at. position I'm gonna go ahead and start sewing it down by the end so I'm gonna sew down from the very end corner and I'm just gonna keep sewing it up and I'm gonna sew one side and then just sew the other side and then sew down the middle so that's basically what you're gonna see in this part should basically look like once you sew down both sides and then sew down the center and at the back of it as well. so now I'm basically gonna just be gluing the tracks literally one by one I'm sorry that the camera does lose focus but basically I'm gonna just keep gluing it gluing it gluing it down until I get to a certain spot and when I get to a certain spot I'm gonna actually change the way I'm gluing it down
about to the middle top of the head, I'm going to now start positioning the tracks and laying them down different. And this you need to make sure you do for the simple fact that if you do not lay it down that way and you keep going straight across, when you put the wig on, it's going to be very bulky and it's going to be like, you're going to have like a basically a huge hump in the back of your head. So laying it down this way and starting to lay it down upwards is going to basically have it laying down flat. And you'll have you a nice wig without no humpy humpy hump. at the top and I probably have one or two more tracks to, to glue down and basically I'm gonna glue it down and really hold it down because I want this part to be very very flat so if you so that's just something that you should do whether you're sewing it down or gluing it down you want to make sure that that part right there is very excuse me, flat and seamless So basically this is what your lace frontal should look like once you've finished it and glued all the hair together and yeah that's how it should look so I'm gonna go ahead and take it apart out of the ponytail I put it closer so you guys can actually get a view so now I'm just gonna take the hair and comb it back and blend it out and get it to my liking second to last part you're just going to want to go ahead and cut the band of, of where your lace frontal is laying right there do not cut the opposite side of where I'm cutting keep cutting this part just so that band won't be on your forehead with your lace kind of idea what your lace frontal wig should basically look like and this is it on my mannequin this is how it is just showing you a little model a little show show and that's basically how I created my lace frontal wig Okay guys, so that is the end of that video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope it was very helpful to you because I've watched a lot of videos on how I make, well, how to make lace wigs. So why not make one? The first one I made came out really good. So why not make one and kind of show you guys learned how I learned. So this is the hair and stay tuned for my install video. I'll probably have a link down below by the time it's posted. 